All right, today we're gonna bring a best weight new pool. It's about 14 by eight by two feet. All right, so we're gonna set this up. I'm putting lining on a, a lining on the ground first prior to setting up. So it does come in a lot of pieces. I'm gonna show you all the pieces that it comes with. It comes with plenty of boxes. So we're gonna start setting it up and see how it works. So it says it's gonna take us about 30 minutes, but 30 minutes when you're doing multiple people by yourself, it's gonna take longer. All right, so I arranged it where it's gonna be perfectly fit. Um, just make sure you're, you're aware where you're gonna to have to have the tubing for the actual filter system. And it does come with a filter, a small little filter, but we're gonna add it, actually add our own sand filter. It has a glass. So when you're swimming, you can see kids in here if you're sitting in front of it. Or not only that, you can see how clean the water is by looking at through the glass too. So, so the great thing we, we bought this one for, just to see how it looks on that one. I wanna set this monstrosity of pool up and see how it works. Finally finished it guys. It's super large. I like it. Those two pieces at the end were the hardest ones because it took me about maybe a, an hour and 20 minutes by myself. But of course, if you have two or three people, less time, easier to pick up. I was doing everything by myself. I kind of got used to doing these pools, taking them off and on. New generation of kids don't want to help. <laughs> So it's the adults, the old generation to put these things together. Um, but they enjoy them more than do I. So we're gonna fill it up with water. We're gonna set up our tanks, our filter system, and make sure that A is where it's coming back in, B is going out, and B is going out. So we got two Bs coming out and one A going back in. So I'm gonna set this up right now. And see how it works at the end so let's set up the filter not the one that I came with we're gonna set up a different filter but I like this glass uh, maintenance is very simple on this one it's not that big to keep filling it up with too many chemicals just make sure you test it out once in a while make sure the water is clean um, if you have a machine that cleans the actual carpet part of it. It's really good. I recommend you guys keep your maintenance. We're gonna do another video on maintenance on this, all right? So, all right, here's the pool, guys. Finally finished it. I do have a wrinkle. I couldn't get rid of it. I like this part. This is my favorite part. You can watch the kids from the seat. Now, I did have to modify this pool. It came with a smaller hole, half an inch or an inch hole. I had to do the actual larger one. I'm gonna put it up so you guys can see what I did. I modify it just so I can install this sand filter. Unfortunately, this system, the filter that it comes with, is not very reliable, not very good at all. And you're gonna get a lot of greenish, and you're gonna do a lot more maintenance. So my recommendation, if you buy a pool like this, you are gonna have to modify this, all right? As you can see, I did modify this part. And <coughs> I don't recommend you guys if you're hesitant. Uh, unless you want to get a filter like this strong, you're going to have to modify this. This is a must. If you don't, you're going to end up adding something like this. And it's not reliable for this sun. It's just, this, this is a very strong filter. This is going to be reliable. This is sucking a lot of water in and it's blowing a lot of water out. Something like this is going to pop out. You do this overnight or something happens, you're going to come back for a mess. So my recommendation, if you're going to buy a pool like this, get a filter something like this the filter that comes with is no good at all uh, they're cracking down where they're not spending too much money on the actual system itself the modify holes they don't come with that no more you have to modify this the system itself I like the color of it the aesthetics looks beautiful 
you guys can see that but i prefer getting the actual system properly set up for a system like this if you're going to buy even from best get best way or index you're going to have to modify that one now these are natural but i'm also going to add something because if you guys notice they sag a lot and this the sun kills these holes throughout the day and time they're starting to start leaking so my recommendation is get maybe something so it can help you not sag and i do have a solution for that we're going to set it up in another video but for now this saw i'm going to have it right here you don't have to have what i have but you can have your own float your own system uh they do give you an actual uh chlorine system it's very small very petite one drop you could fill in it that one actually takes two and good enough for this uh, I do have a skimmer for this. I do have a uh, a robot pool that cleans underneath. Um, I'm, my recommendation, enjoy it first. But when you get it, enjoy it out of the box. Uh, if you're a 200 pound guy or girl, don't use the ladder it comes with. Very, very flimsy. It's going to fall apart. That's last year's ladders. we actually not even going to install the new one. We actually bought a different model. We're going to install it. So best way it's a it's a good model it's just these modifications i wish they had added from last year i mean they're just getting a little bit cheaper and less expensive and they want you to buy more filters that's why they include this their pump this is not eye pump this is a sand pump i never have to include any filters i just include the sand pump and that's it now if you're going to buy something like this for best way get the index or the best way sand filter or vbor they're pretty good uh, best way less modifications i had to modify this one uh index less modifications you don't need modifications too um generic ones or vivor you do have to modify things these systems don't come i had to book converters on these all right that's my only recommendation when you have kids watch them all the time even if it's a one foot of water keep an eye on them it's very safe to keep a pairing outside and have them enjoy every summer uh, putting away this thing is it's not that hard you're gonna have to have some lifts underneath maybe some chairs so it could dry up the entire system before you put it away um, once you take it out of the box you cannot put it back in the box it's impossible and that's it watch your water flow on uh, the last one they actually had lines here where you actually could see how much water you but unfortunately on this one you don't see the lines they they took them out uh i don't recommend you going above the actual glass i mean i would recommend you above that where the flow water flows out and that's about it but overall this is your best way pool very simple easy to use i hope you guys enjoy the video 99.6 of you are not subscribers in my channel i hope that the content helps you out and that you find it very useful and i hope you hit the like and subscribe